Is your elevator machine room ready to pass inspection? I'm going to cover several key items related to the elevator machine room inspection in five minutes or less. <laughs> Hi, I'm Mike Simmons with TK Elevator, and in five minutes or less, I'm going to talk to you about several different items that you'll need to make sure are complete before your elevator machine room is ready for inspection. Now, every jurisdiction is different, so make sure you check with your local elevator representative for any items that may be specific to your jurisdiction. Number one, a self-closing, self-locking machine room door. That means when this door closes automatically, it will lock. Number two, at least seven feet of clear headroom. That means you need at least seven feet between the floor and your electrical conduit. Number three, nothing that is not elevator related may pass through your machine room. So you can't have a sprinkler line go through the machine room or you can't have an air conditioning duct pass through the machine room. It has to terminate within your machine room. Number four, don't forget your ABC fire extinguisher. Number five, a natural or mechanical means to regulate the temperature and humidity of your machine room. Here you can see a thermostat and the vent specific to this machine room. Number six, a fused disconnect that is lockable in the open position. Number seven, a convenience outlet. It's very important that this outlet has a GFI. Number eight, 19 foot candles of light. Hi there, let's talk about penetration. Number nine, any item that penetrates into the machine room must be fire stopped. This includes your hydraulic line and your electrical line. Fire protection. Now this can vary by jurisdiction, but as a general rule of thumb, you're going to need at least a minimum of a smoke detector. If you have sprinkler lines in your machine room, you'll also need to have a heat detector within two feet of the sprinkler head, and it's going to need to shunt the controller. That concludes my short video on elevator machine room requirements. I hope that you found it informative and interesting. Until next time, stay safe and stay elevated.